Thanks for staying with us after the game. While well, the Ravens showed up and showed out tonight in Tampa Bay, beating the Buccaneers 41 to 31. WMER 2 News' Xavier Weary has been watching the game, and he joins us now to break it down play by play. Kelly, what a game it was. And coming into tonight, I mentioned how the Ravens had the number one offense in the league and the best rushing attack. But tonight was a special all-around performance from this team. Let's go ahead and get straight to the highlights. Much like the first two games of the season, the first few drives didn't start how the Ravens would have liked. Here's Mayfield connecting with Mike Evans for an early score. But the Ravens would settle in. Here you see Zay Flowers dancing and weaving up the field on this 19-yard right to end run which would set up this history-making play. Lamar takes the snap and finds Mark Andrews, who now sits all alone as the franchise's leading leader in touchdown receptions. That was number 42 in his career. And the question is, how about that pass defense that ranks 31st? Well, they stepped up and made plays. Marlon Humphrey picking off Baker Mayfield in the back of the end zone. And sometimes one just ain't enough. Humphrey said, you know what? I think I'll take another one, please, and thank you. Humphrey picks off Baker Mayfield for the second interception of the game and the 17th of his career, but this one came with a price to pay. He would leave the game with a knee injury and would not return, but the Ravens would take advantage. Justice Hill takes this screen pass 18 yards into the end zone. The Ravens would take the lead, and guess what? They never looked back. Here in the third quarter, you're going to see Lamar spreading the wealth. He threw an absolute dime to Rashad Bateman for this 49-yard touchdown. Rashad Bateman went for over 100 yards for the first time this year. And if you're wondering, this is a highlight. Where is Derrick Henry? He came alive late. After a slow start in this game and only four carries in the first half, he torched the Bucks defense for an 81-yard run, eclipsing 100 yards in the game for the fourth game in a row. That's six foot three, 247 yards running that fast. And remember earlier when the talk was, can the Ravens close games? Well, how about going for it on fourth and three, up 17? Lamar connecting with Andrews for his second score of the game. It was so good to see everyone get involved in this ball game. Mark Andrews, uh, Bateman, as I mentioned earlier, Justice Hill. Lamar even had a fantastic game. And speaking of Lamar, he is now 23 and one against the NFC all time, and he is now six and zero against the NFC South. What an absolute game tonight was, Kelly.